Hey Cam Ites, this is Abe Ferrer. I, I'm not actually a staff member at Cam, I'm just a fan. This is not actually supposed to be a video for me, it's supposed to be a video intro by Masashi who's standing here off to my right, but he's obviously a little bit shy about doing this intro. But let me explain to you what's happening, right? We're here at Vancouver International Film Festival, and basically what it is is that while Masashi's here until Tuesday, he's supposed to be doing a little bit of a report as to like the sights and sounds of VIF um, 2010. So listen up, Cam, and all you Cam family folks. Uh, this is this is the video here. Enjoy. In this episode, we meet Suang Ng. Okay, hi. My name is Suang Ng, and uh, I made a short film called Nature Nature on Its Course, and it got into the Toronto Real Asian Festival. The inspiration for the film came when I. Um, observe the differences between Vancouver and Singapore's um, sort of uh, attitude towards the environment and um, basically it's a short film about a chain of events that happens um, when this hunter goes out and does his daily routine. I recently started out uh, as an animator. I just graduated from Emily Carr last year and uh, with an animation degree and I um, sort of jumped into animation without knowing anything and came from a graphic design background and so like using a time-based medium it's a lot more flexible and you can use a lot of different mediums and, yeah I don't typically have like a you know idol or anything um, I tend to draw my experiences and inspirations from just like everyday life and mm -hmm. whatever I see like sculptures paintings I tend not to like try and follow too much of like animation artists okay. and try and look outside the box a little bit. Um, so that's where the inspirations came from. The film is quite a different, it's a mixed media, um, done in a mixed media style and so yeah, there's a lot of different um, techniques used. When you make a film I think it's, it's important not to think too much of the audience and um, concentrate on the story that you want to tell and eventually, I mean, the story will shine through and the audience will, will understand and pick it up. So.